<laughs> let's do your level one's points. Let's. So wait, this is gonna be the um, the version with the ogre fist dominance, by the way, basically. Um, this is one of the versions that ended up getting. Well, this version got re-released, basically. So that's how it is. It's Rampy Conflux. Conflux being the dominant faction of the two by pretty fine. Ooh, all right. Infernal Dungeon, so Dungeon being the dominant of the two here. But like, you see, in this version, the side zones are really, really good, and also the bombs is pretty good. With side zones being relevant, the rushing mid is not as much of a factor as it used to be. So yeah. Not it yet, would you, would you be interested in casting? Would be fun to watch after. Um, yeah, probably. I reached out to Phantom recently, it's like, hey, I see no one's casting in English, you know, I'm... I might know a guy that might want to do some, you know. That's me. Um, so yeah, I'll be getting updates for like most of the matches that will be going on in Ponton Cup, especially the bigger ones, and um, yeah, I'll be casting some of those. So that is something that I'm interested in doing. Hey, Zanza. Uh, 2 1 0, 15 is played on all MMR levels. Uh, yeah, but only for the one hero formats. Uh, there's also like a um, less timer. You can just like create a room with more timer, especially if you're like a little bit lower. Then people will just join and you can play that. Wait, actually, I should be making a decision. Let's go minus Inferno. I'm a little bit scared of Inferno. Though, then again, this is the version where you could go 1000 demons. Zamog Bashnia. Damn. You. Wait, actually, in this version, isn't Tower better? Hey, Arnox. Hey, Citrus. Hey, Zika. I think Tower is better in this version than Castle. I'll just pass him, he can play with uh, Castle. I think that's fine-ish. Alkern with Rain. Welcome, dude. Appreciate the Rain. Poor Hondo. Hey, Chai. Hey, Jazz. <laughs> so, summon Hondo. I mean, color doesn't matter that much here because uh, there's not as much tempo pressure. He chooses red on I version. Hmm, I don't know about that. In I version, I don't know, he's making some questionable decisions to say the very least. We also go Astral because the game usually tends to go like way more late game, and if the game goes more late game, then every single skill in your skill set is gonna be more important than it otherwise would be. Um, uh, making it so that Solami is a sorcerer. Well, actually, the sorcerer is not that bad with the... Nah, it's still bad, it's still bad. So is intelligence, by the way. Intelligence is bait. Do you know the map Fifth Element? Nope. Good luck in the game, thank you. Hello, Mr. Holland player who never loses. Hey, Tobio Fish. One for two cents, that's pretty good. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the mother load! Oh my god, it's a mother load. We have uh, over 300 gremlins already. That's. Wow. Yeah, that's wow. Let's see where the road splits off so I can make better decisions. Uh, certainly not at this side. Okay. So I can. Go over here, immediately pick up the Gremmels, and then go back to the other side. Hopefully these guys... Uh, the best case scenario would be that I'm going for the unupgraded Gremlin Balls right now, and then the next one will be upgraded. That would be the literal best. That's a great story, and quite good puzzles, and good battle as well. Um, yeah. There's still, like, so much that, that I am doing, and will be doing. Oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. Okay, the first of two is uh, pretty favorable. Ah, yeah, da, da, da. I have 10,000 gremlins! You can't get away with this! Hey, you this? I had actually like almost 300 gremlins on day one! On day one! Bro, like, okay. Saj. Mm hmm. Oh, look, I thought to get a better idea of the map. We have a lamb that's on the road, which means that I don't see my mouse, apparently. Wait, my mouse is gone. 
What? I can tell where it is. Can you guys see the mouse? I cannot see my mouse. What the hell? Okay, I can see it over here, but I cannot see it in game. Um. Uh. What the hell? <laughs> Challenge mode activated. Uh, maybe after a reset, it's gonna pop back up. I don't know. When I alt tap out, I see the mouse. Maybe if I alt the four? No. I can't even move. Oh yeah, I can now. Oh yeah, I can move with the <laughs> with keyboard. Hey, Snarly. Let's see. Do I have a mouse? No, I have no mouse. I keep trying to fix, but can't. Uh, reload the game real quick. Thanks, sorry. <clears throat> Alright. There we go, now I have a mouse. I don't- Where did my mouse go? What is that? Hey, Power Rush. Hey, Mac. <laughs> you can't eat him. Apparently so. Hey, Bear Man. So, can maybe restore a tiny bit of my sanity. Now, that's more correct than last time. Now, that's more correct. I'm pretty sure that most of it is like pretty irrecoverable by this point. It's gone into the. into the grain of the great unknown, but yeah. Mal stopped watching stream. He wasn't entertained. <laughs> okay, now we can play. And this is the map that we're playing. Hey, BMF. So, the road is, yeah. Very simple, nice and clear. We have a, a excuse me. Ah, uh, we have a lamp on the road, pretty easy and nice. Ah, I took the golems. Nah, I should probably delete them. Or maybe I can make it to the uh, black tower. Yeah, maybe I can just sack the golems away. No, I would probably die there. So yeah, it's kind of whatever. Okay, Oceanus, help me deal with my golem problem. Thanks for nothing. Oh wait, no. These, yeah, okay, cool. I should have saved them, but whatever. Oh, we also need some bosses in the biome. Not bad, not bad. Should be high tempo, nice game. I have a question. I like to start my online horror adventure. Where should I start? Where can I purchase the game? Thanks in advance. Hey, Huxley. You either need any original version that you might have lying around of the game, or the best version to get is actually from GOG.com. They have the complete original version. On top of that, you can install the expansion that is Horn the Abyss. Um, Horn the Abyss is fan-made, so it's like completely free. Um, and in there, from there, you'll be able to reach the online lobby where you can just host uh, games and play with people of your own skill level. And good luck! Who's opponent in faction? I'm playing against uh, Marjoram. Ah, uh, wait, what's his name exactly? Yeah, Marjoram. I ended up encountering this guy for the first time, like uh, a little while ago. Like a real little, little while ago. I think that was yesterday, my first game against him. But I had like a good time against him already so far. And this game, he's playing Castle, and we're playing Dual 2.69i, which are basically a re release of 2.69i Jeebus Outcast that used to be around for like a long time. In this version, it, the Ogre Fist is dominant, remember? Those times. Saban! That's amazing. That's a lot of army. Maybe I can get do this as well. Yeah, I can for sure. Nice.
Some da. Hmm. Oh. What the fuck? Wait, he has all. Oh, where is him, huh? Okay. Huh, interesting. Wow. I. Hmm. Yeah, that's pretty spicy. That's pretty bad. Wait, it was my ore. I'll not be able to buy schools of magic immediately. Without any ore. Oh man. I'll have to build marketplaces and trade, I guess, for like a little bit. Nah. I... Well, actually, gold mines kind of do matter. Nah, it's whatever. It's fine. Air? No, no. We go for the. Magic University route every time. Uh, no reason to recover mana right now, so I'll just stay like this so we can start recovering some of the manas. Uh, my scrolls are over here in this region, that's also fine. I need a marketplace for sure. I'll probably need a little bit more as well, but I'll see. Um, after the scroll, I can definitely TP back. Yeah, I'll be TP back over to, like, more. Then I'll pick up the Schools of Magic, and then I can leave, and I already have, like, quite a bit of tempo. I definitely want to get the other towns and so on. My... Fall Expert Control is gonna be coming around, like, at, like, a pretty good uh, timing. By the way, he actually went that lane. What a guy. Actually knows how to play the video game. Um, is this just duel without talking? Uh, Angelic Alliance? Well, not exactly. There's like a lot that goes into this. Okay, we're going back to Ogmore. Then... We're picking up the University of Magic. Just barely, barely stripping by for it, but... Hey. As long as I am, then that's good enough. Ah, uh, do I want the gold mine? That's a question, actually. Dude, I might have wanted that as well. Well, no, no, I'm, by, now, by this point I'm certainly heading north to the town. We have to find... Yeah, we certainly have to find the castle site town. And I also still want the uh, sawmill as well, but I would like to get the, like all these things with control spells rather than just walking everywhere. Um, how's this game? Doing great. So far. Hey, Cyber. Uh, will we see Jace? Will we see JC on your channel again? Yeah, of course. Probably eventually. I'll uh, go, go. That's a... Whoa, that's really an amazing package. Yeah, knowledge is really good. Dude, but my opponent is going to be like turboing. He has a sentinel shield for free immediately. That is going to be hard to deal with. By the way, this is actually a good auto. Another seven. This also means that I have no more gold. Uh, this envelope over here, and also the generated soldier boss is looking pretty nice as well. Yeah, I could collect this package and then TP back over to my main. You know what? Yeah, let's do exactly that. I can also pick up uh, marketplaces right now. Well, I shall want to have the gold, not right now. Why not playing 2.81? Uh, because I'm playing dual, there's no 2.81 dual. And as I usually say, I just play the version that my opponent prefers. In this case, my opponent does Marjoram, and in this case, he preferred either an old version uh, of Duel, of Duel, or the I version, which was re-released recently. So yeah, I was always like the latest thing. So here we are. <laughs> Q enter is good. Knowledge. That is also good. Grimmels, really good. Hmm, I'm not able to actually TP back on this turn. Ooh, that's pretty bad. From here? Yeah, actually I can, but then I'm not getting the wood. But getting the... Uh, getting the resources is better, so... 
whatever. Uh, then we go Mage Guild, and then... Yeah, we have a really good amount of army. We have Control, Schools of Magic, and Gahai Knowledge. Uh, this will lead into, like, a very turbo with Tia, I believe. Oh, which is naturally very nice. <laughs> I also want to get more... I don't know, I cannot build the... Yeah, I cannot build the thing that I wanted to build. Whatever. I don't have the gold for the... Actually, I do if I go for the church shop. Another lost streak. I hate this game. <laughs> have you ever considered winning? It's really that simple. Oops. Uh huh. No, that's a pretty good outcome from that objective. 38, damn, bro. Alright, alright. Chill, yo. Wait, our hypnotize is really powerful. Okay, let's do that. Nice. Good. Dude, we're actually rocking it. Yeah, we're super powerful. The tower is actually broken on this version, I guess. There's no other explanation. Okay, there's another explanation. I'm just really good at the video game, but... Yeah, actually, that one is far more reasonable. Hmm... How do we play this one? Not bad, and then I'll do this just for the sake of experience, really. Uh, yep. Honestly, I don't even want the Nagas. Uh, yeah, then back into main. Now we have full, full control already, at very good timing. Wait, winning is an option! No way, bro, let me try that, BRB! <laughs> okay, good luck, Mikas. Hmm... This is actually a huge box. Mmm, okay. Then yeah, I'll chill here for this turn, just to get to the town. And yeah, it's castle, nice. I went exactly into the town that I wanted to. Mmm, not bad, not bad. I can also get the marketplaces now that I have wood, and I also have wood income, that's... yeah. In here, in this version, you usually build up to, like, real late games, so... Uh huh. I should be aware of that immediately. Is there any fight that I wouldn't be able to do? Anyway, this fight I can always do, so. Hey, Ishpatari. I'm gonna be working like pretty soon by now, right? There's not a lot more that I need. By the way, do I wanna look at my opponent's stats? I probably don't, huh? Not bad. No, actually he is, uh, considering he started the game off with the line shield, I mean, sorry, with the central shield, he is actually not really looking that hot. Ooh, this is a genie boss. All right, spicy. Uh, I can go for the blast buff over here, then I have enough resources for support. Yeah, pretty much whatever I need, I guess. Hmm. I probably want that boss in this box. Decent boss. Well, yeah, there's like so many good bosses to go for. Uh, the best part is that I'm going through these bosses, like, very fast and efficient. Um, is it gear or I version? Hey, hey, hi. This is the I version. 
Social Beatrice. In this version, I would go for that as well, Paul. Do you think uh, taking tier 6 Wings is uh, a valid strat, or do you prefer bosses and break with that army? Um, tier 6 Duel Val... I mean, it's a solid strat, but it really depends on what you're looking to have. Like, uh, tier 6 Dwellings would actually have more longevity in the match, so if you are assuming that you're gonna go late game, that that might actually be the primary option for you, immediately. But, in my experience, going for boxes and tempo and breaking faster and playing off of mid or the side zone is gonna need you more success and more of a win rate. Um, so yeah. I'll play K-version and it stinks as fuck. Why? Okay. I really don't know what, like, all the hate about of that version is all about. I just really don't get it, but... Then again, this is what... This was... This is actually the way that almost every single new version ever was met, so... Yeah, I guess it's like just a period that people will just be like that. Uh, the opponent has currently three towns, he's still chilling in the biome. Okay, okay. Well, that is nice. I am not intending to actually be outside of the castle by the end of this turn. <laughs> yes, okay, cool, perfect. So, it's RMP mid, so mid is gonna be not so important at all, I guess. I'm picking up like a few more bosses and then I'm already heading for the break. Uh, the bosses that I'm really looking for are going to be... Uh, this one. Actually, yeah, I can probably do the Unicorn boss and then break already. Hey, Aaron Grajvas. New question, why not go out to the lamp and bank under the castle town? Is it too far away? Hmm, yeah, I mean, like, I would be going here only for, like, a lamp. If I was gonna be around to do the going boxes, then yeah, I guess I would head up the lamp too. But the lamp as a sole destination is probably kind of, eh, meh. Why do you want to break without uh, making the giant dwellings? Um, because giants kind of suck and titans are too big of an investment to think about uh, currently. If I wanted to make a giant uh, titan stack in a Jeeba Southcast on the current version, I would be needing diplomacy and I would be needing to double some giants to upgrade into titans. The main uh, point of being tower would actually be to upgrade the giants into titans, not to accumulate them through income. Uh, the only way you can accumulate a good amount of power stack for income of army is usually by getting middle, and then middle has like a bunch of dwellings and also you can like double build. Um, now that is when you actually get like a, a really good amount of army income. But that does not really happen after your two to three dwellings in the castle. And not to mention that's like a, such a big investment that you lose out on tempo. Uh, you could be using to get stats, get control, get combo activities, get ready, you know, all of that good stuff. Mm -hmm. I can go stable by now, that is amazing. I don't know, do I wanna break immediately? I'll see what the break is, I guess. And then make my final option, I mean my final decision. Hey, factory. In the current version, like, side zones are actually like king of army production, by the way. In this version, specifically. Armor is not as good as leadership. Um, uh, they will run. How the hell? Well, yeah, I, okay, I get how you lose your genius here. All my lamps have been pretty big. Oh, Hydra. Uh, do I have Bless? I do. Okay, so it's easy. Uh, I can probably reach that down as well. That's amazing. Okay, that's a pretty early break. 1, 2, 5 as Tower. Pretty good. Pretty good. I like that. Considering I'm playing up against somebody that has a Relic on day 1. <laughs> yeah, I'll take it. Um... Magic Arrows are good. Oh wait, that doesn't kill, okay. This doesn't reach anything, okay, that's good. Mm, 
this fight kind of sucks. I should have got it better, but let's... Yeah, just move on. Ah, no, I cannot afford the Mage Gun. By the way, we're almost at the... Olgafils by now, I guess. Yeah, we need, like... I can try to free. Nah, just will not cut it, huh? Okay. So all I can do is I make, can make myself fast, that's it. Then, in order to get mana next turn, I guess I can go to the Magic Ball. Mm, yeah, that's gonna be the choice. Uh, strongest side zone, by the way. One of the strongest side zones in the entire game currently available. Well, because castle is taken because of my opponent's castle. The strongest remaining one. I do not want to run in there immediately into the side zone. I want to be farming up the, uh, the middle just a tiny little bit. Like, for example, taking the a little bit of stat. My stats here is going to be very, very helpful in order to get my... You know, side zone play to be way better. And yeah, by the way, side zone stronghold should win against main zone castle. Because side zones are way better. Oh, double that's good. Really good, actually. Ah, uh, this is also Olgafist pieces, which is extra bonus. I can also afford to not go back into the town this turn, because I'm getting the vortex. So yeah, that's good, that's good. Mmm, I can do D though. Did he back? Did he forward? Mm, did he back? Mm hmm. Then this time can fly, Vortex, and then go in and start on the castle side zone. Yep. It seems like the opponent's actually breaking as well by this point. Probably. Oh, but I'm not gonna be having like the stable bonus if I were to go to, towards the castle right now. So it might not actually be a good timing. Oh, my sister. Yeah, pretty good. Hey, Rossi. Where have you been? What do you mean, where have I, where have I been, Sneaky? I've been shooting for... Ah, uh, quite a few past days in a row by now. Let's see, is he in the desert? No, I don't know. He's actually not breaking yet, so I still have, like, perfect timings. Uh, I can use the Vortex on this week and still have the Vortex on the new week available. Ooh, no, that's not good. Um, That is really good, though. Like, this is really, really good. It's okay if I bleed away all, like pretty much all of my tower army. I'll transition into being stronghold. Dude, this is actually the, sto the story of Yogg. How we go from being a lowly... A lowly caster, tower dude, into being a buff wizard. I mean, a buff stronghold guy. More accurate gameplay. Actually, I really want to protect the... Grumlands, I guess. Force of the field! Yeah! This is gonna be like Ancient Behemoths or something, by the way. It's amazing. It's really good. Um, Scouting is important. Okay, Sack of Kings. We'll do. We'll do. Um, certainly very good. Then we can get a bunch more boxes as well. Yeah, nice. Uh, we have Graduated Gremlins. Rock. I can still Dimension Door in this turn. Mm, okay, I'll be doing that. I'll be doing that. Uh, we have to watch out for Ogrefist pieces, because clearly the Ogrefist is still... Well, actually, there's Protection of Fire now. I wonder if that will actually supersede... The... If that will actually change what the best and slot thing is. These guys might be deployable, but whatever. Actually, I kind of want to farm everything. So I'll just farm everything here. And that's gonna be nice. I could also go back for stability, but nah, not yet, not yet. Why give me be he? Find some soul zone farm, side zone farming. Yeah, we're playing the I version, so yeah. Not spending genius into one size makes me mad, bro. Um, timer and also like whatever. 
It's valuable, but... Meh. I can go here, go here. These spells don't cast any uh, don't cost any mana, that's like very cool. Shield. Wait, but we are not looking for that because that's like not the end game that we're planning to have. Oh, go buy Magi. Yeah, I guess we graduated Magi. All the stacks are getting graduated. Hmm. I really want to reach the uh, town by next turn. <sighs> he might be coming. Ooh, and he's red. Ooh. No, but I would be more ready than him. I have like a bunch of Cyclops. Yeah, I'm gonna throw rocks at him if he comes. I will, I will <laughs> rock him. Uh, we have a bunch of ogres too. I really wish I could have a Thunderbird pass, a uh, Thunderbird stack as well soon. Q enter. Oh, I'm good. Expert scouting is amazing. Yeah, I, I'm actually really happy with my position. Uh, this time I can get this box, this box. I can go stable up, I can vortex, and then, yeah, we're almost like good to go. By the way, in this region, I think there's uh, spell boxes in the middle. Uh, what this means is that, well, yeah, we can get all casting. He's coming! Oh shit, he's coming! Uh, okay. Then I can go over to this town first. Then I guess I'm going back into main a little bit. No, that doesn't do anything. Let's go over here. Maybe let's get Mage Guild too. No, I can't. Mm, okay, well, dear free spells, I guess. Well, this might be getting interrupted if he reaches this anyway. But yeah, we'll see. We'll see. I am blue after all. Did he get him any more stats? Not really. Okay, so our stats are at least like pretty similar. If I get like one more turn here, just to farm, then yeah, I feel like I'm in a pretty good spot. Uh, do I see any casting? Okay, what do I see that's really important? This boss is amazing, this boss is amazing, um, this OJ is amazing. Oh yeah, so now the sims are completed, so he can farm for basically like another turn, then attack me. But by that point he would not be having any mana, because you know, he has 110 mana and he has already been outside, presumably for two turns in a row. Meaning that this zone should be like mine to claim. That's good, that's good. I think I'm establishing dominance in this game already. I'm missing the Ogre Fist and the Lion Shield for the sake of the Ogre Fist. Um, that's something that we should pay attention to. Uh, I see the Vile for the Elixir, but I don't think I see the rings yet. Yeah, the Vile is over here. Though, that's honestly not a very good position. <laughs> Even though the shop hard things, pretty good! Hey, Coconut! Hypno gonna be clutch. Possibly. Honestly, Hypno tends to be pretty good in early fights. <laughs> okay, he's going mid. He's not pressuring me at all. So, yeah. I can find the side zone however much and however in whatever fashion I like. It is mine to claim. It is my right. This deals a lot of damage. And I can do this, 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 this. Yeah, that's amazing. Uh, pretty good way we solved the fight. Not, honestly, I still lost like quite a bit here. More than I thought I would. Anyway, eight behemoths. Uh, but yeah, maybe I should have went for Sat first. So that's sort of a nice help here. Mm, I want to leave the Thunderbirds for Diplo. Also Behemoths for Diplo possibly as well. 
Ogres will be like a very big time pal stack in this game. <laughs> this was the way to minimize damage, by the way. The swap up to them so they can't just me, at the very least. Mm -hmm. Okay, what else are we doing in this turn? Uh, oh, permanence is like pretty important, then yeah, I can grab this. The gloves are gonna be kinda nice. I'm losing like a lot in these fights though, surprisingly so. Maybe I shouldn't be surprised, but it is what it is. Um, take, 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 here, here. And build something at the very least. I mean, I actually ended up bleeding like so much of this army away. Well, at least I'm not bleeding the behemoths or... And I'm still building up army instead, so it's all good. Kind of. Mm-hmm. I'm not taking any utopias yet either. Missed the ancient behe. In refugee camp. Yeah, I mean, there's no am. I... That's not a very important object. I could be pushing mid tier. If I really wanted to. Uh, the most important cast here... Wait, there's air elementals in this version, right? Yeah, there's oxygen. Hmm. Will the upgrade augers? Yeah, for sure. I want to build up all uh, this entire... Enti I want to build up this town entirely. For sure. I can take my two utopias next turn. That will give me enough resources to be able to trade, to trade up everything else that I want to get. Yeah, okay, I'll do that. Uh, the way that I'll do it is I will save these guys. I'll probably sack away all my beer. I'll probably end up losing pretty much every master team that I have. For the sake of this, but so be it. I think it's going to be good at the end of the loss. Uh, the ogres are gonna be clear carries here. Nice scene. Um, some of these are not bad, but okay, go. Mm, that will do. Damn, I got like a bunch of trash. Um, okay, so what I'm gonna do with this is I wanna get every single marketplace available. I have most of them, huh? Our stronghold one is actually the most important, but whatever. Whatever. Okay, I'll be able to trade later. Anyway, two toppies in a single turn is like still like, a pretty good thing to do. Now I have a bunch of gold, and I also have diplomacy, so I'll be able to start diploing things. For example, the Thunderbirds over here are like good, would be like a very nice diplo. But then potentially angels and giants are good diplos as well, because I would be able to uh, eventually upgrade the giants into titans, of course. I'm really like to see Lickshot's disgusting game with Ancient Behe and the uh, life region thing. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Elixir of Life, Ancient Behe on Castle on like day three, amazing. Hey, Tilan. Hey, Frap. Like, child, don't you have to break into side biome? Ah, uh, no, you don't. There's the universal break rule. Not to mention there's no breaks to the side biome, even if uh, you had to, so... I guess they would be inaccessible. You have a life shield under your strong main. I know, but life shield is not the best slot artifact to get. It would be kind of nice to get it, like for free or something, but... Yeah, something that you go... It's not something that you would go out of your way for. Have all those goals of magic. Um, eventually the old spells boss is gonna be important too. I actually need to trade up a bunch of resources. So yeah, I understand I'll just uh, swing by a few bosses and then I uh, will be using some of my timer in order to go to the match uh, to the Arctic Merchants in this town in order to get like ore, crystal, wood, and maybe some gold, I don't know. I don't know about the gold part at all. I fixed them. Uh, currently my stats are looking better. I used to have some casting already, my army is looking fine, it's developing. I'm looking to get an Ancient Behe stack, right? Yeah, Ancient Behe is gonna be what it's all about for me this game. I'm probably eventually even gonna be collecting the Behe Dwellings as well to help me out with this. Are we terrible today? Hell yeah we are. I mean, naturally we are, of course. 
It seems like we are more on point than the opponent this game. He has middle control, which is kind of scary for me. I mean, there's gonna be like a bunch of stats there, and also more item selection, but... Yeah, what, what is he gonna build? Gold dragons? Good luck with that. Uh, he's in Northern Town over there, that's fine. Insulted by the refusal. I have to save some timer here. As I said, I have some plans with my timer, so... Uh, wonderful. I'll take the arty. Yeah, I'm gonna take the, the arty there just so I can sell it. Uh, wait then, Q and pay. Logan match iron, nice. Uh, this is nice. Okay, play fast, play fast, play fast. Bruh. Uh, that's some losses, but whatever. That's a really, really good box. Then, uh, we go with like more. Then I need to collect the rest of the marketplaces. Mm, then... In like more, we make fast, we get the auto merchants, and then we have to sell quite a bit. I know I have two of these, so I can sell one of these immediately. Uh, this is gonna be crystal, let's say this is gonna be ore ore. Let's say wood, uh, crystal, crystal, crystal. Okay. I have wood or crystal, which is exactly what I wanted to have. Okay, so that was like a pretty successful turn. Bunch of boxes, marketplace is complete. Yeah, 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 this is like a really nice turn, I think. Um, is this the new version? This is one of the two new versions, but I mean, if you read the patch notes, there's two new release dual versions. Uh, dual 2.69i, which is a uh, throwback to Jibasawakai's 2.69i, where uh, Ogrefist was dominant. And then there's the new 2.69k, which apparently people are not very accepting of, for some reason, so yeah. Because I let the opponent choose the version that we play, the opponent chose this one, and yeah, that's what we're playing. Um, that's why the side is like, so relevant, because yeah, it's that version. Weren't all Angelic Alliance things removed? Not all of them. In this version, there's only no Tipa. In K version, I don't think there's the Lion Shield or the SOJ as well. Actually, I'm not sure about the Lion Shield. But I don't think it's there. Uh, this is probably all spells. Maybe? Yeah, probably. There's all spell bosses in this version too in the desert that we could snatch. Or we could just go for the one in the, um, you know, in the underground over here. I think most of them. Not most of them, half of them. Uh, am I looking to sell anything more? Not really looking to. I guess we could equip this as well. Am I getting pressured in any sort of way? Um, the answer is kind of yeah, actually. Okay, he's trying to farm the stronghold zone al alongside me. What are you doing, buddy? The zone is mine. I licked it first. Oh, uh, the ogre club, that's pretty important. Yikes. Well, that's kind of a mistake on my part. I guess I'm just picking up the old club, I guess. Well, that's something. Uh, the opponent's are looking pretty good. So I have to be, like, a little bit worried. If the fight could happen, like, very, very soon, then I would be in some danger. I should visions the Thunderbirds over here. I mean, they could be like fairly be joining. Then I can upgrade these, and you know, by that point, it would be a pretty nice pal stock. If he, I mean, could he claim the zone away from me? I think the answer is no. But in order for that to actually be a no, I would need to claim the Tomb of Air Magic over here. Uh, with Tomb of Air Magic, of course, I would be able to just duel him away. I guess, probably. No, maybe I would like to go for the Lion Shield. Yeah, just go down. No, I don't think I have that many moves. This isn't duel. There's zero spell box in duel. Well, not in desert. Um, in I version, they used to be right, and this is I version. So there you go. Hmm. <laughs> 
Hey. How are you doing today? Pretty good, pretty good. You're playing I, I see. Okay, for like the third time, uh, the newest release of K version came with a re-release of the I version as well. So this G dual 2.69i, which was released yesterday. <laughs> uh, go, 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 visions, uh, they're fleeing. I don't know what the opponent is like at, at all, unfortunately. Uh, but I do know that I certainly need some... Bleh. That was a lot of losses, okay. Ah, uh, this is gonna be Dendroids, you will tank the, the Utopia for me, hopefully. Oh, that's decent. That's not a very good usage of the gold, but whatever. Uh, I need all the firepower I can have right now, so I will actually take that. On um, this, this, this. Yeah, okay. It will do. So this is my current setup. I have like 40 Cyclops, I have 100 Ogres, Thunderbirds. Yeah, okay. That's fine, it's fine. <laughs> uh, it's become triggered with all this question. No, 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 no. I'm actually pretty happy to, like, explain things. I can I get asked, like, the same thing, like, 10,000 times and still be happy. Um, the only times I would ever get annoyed is when I'm getting asked by the same person the same thing for, like, the third time. That would be the only exception. Oh my god, another friend! Yeah, I'm Appreciate yourself, friend. thank you. Let's see, are you good at basketball? Uh, no, not at all. Look, you went kebab cross. Uh, kebab cross? I don't know. Kebab cross is actually Armageddon Simulator. Mm, when you actually get to uh, play it. The concept is very interesting, though. Okay, so he doesn't have that much mana. His army is, like, slightly better than mine, but not that by that much. He pairs up immediately, but that's not even that good of a cast. I mean, because he cannot get inside with all the bears, right? Hmm... That looks like a golden bow. Yeah, that definitely looks like a golden bow, so I want to get rid of most of his ranged creatures immediately. He has 12 HR behemoths. He either upgraded them in his own town. Yeah, he probably did it. No, wait, no. He literally just got four ancient behemoth boxes. Four ancient behe boxes, though. Lamau. He had, like, so much less room to farm than me, by the way. Free? Oh, yeah. Still, I had, like, so much more room, but I didn't find these. I need to deal with all the range creatures, and after I do, then I'm gonna be in a pretty good spot. I might actually want to delete the catapult as well. Though I do know that he's gonna be having teleport. Oh so the ancient behe are probably getting teleported in, eventually. Uh, but that in mind, I might wanna... Wait, I could be getting Expert Berserk, too. I have to be wary of most of these things. I guess the Angels and the Ogres would be guarding the Cyclops. Uh, yep. That is gonna be the situation. I killed, like, two of his stacks already. He killed one of mine, but not a very important one. And also, Zling! Appreciate yourself, thank you! So is it teleport play right now, or is he taking the slow approach? Can he even afford a slow approach? Yeah, it's teleport, it's teleport every time. But it's like a full cast to just move a little bit, you know? It's not that amazing. And he set up for like a pretty big shower too. Uh, the shower does 85, kills 3, and 14. And then I also get to connect with all my creatures on top of him as, on top of him as well. And if I can just deal with these, then I'm, like, good to go. Um, is that my best approach? I have air elementals. But he would respond with Chain Lightning now. Yeah, he would immediately respond with Chain Lightning, so it's not, like, a very good cast for now, I guess. 
<laughs> yeah, I just want to get rid of wave all of these. Hmm, Kuste can just read down. Of the ancient behem. Um, somebody has to. I think it's gonna be my behemoths, actually. Wait, what version is this? I saw air elementals. Uh, this is dual 2.699. And the most important hit. Yeah, most of these are gone by now. Does he even have offensive casting? He must have. He must have. But I'm superior in terms of mana, too. Like, the biggest threat right now is the Cycle Kings, which are shooting me with Golem Bar. That's, like, really, really damagey. Pretty scary. Uh, what is the cast? Okay, so he still has this caster during this turn. That's pretty scary. There's open doors with all spells in desert, by the way. In I version? Open doors on the surface always gives you an in I version? Really? No, I think you're wrong, aren't you? We always used to have all spells in the final battles every single time in I version, and I don't think that's because we always went to the side to the far bunker every single game. That didn't used to be the case. Open doors on the surface. I K. Wait, is this a change? Okay. Ah, uh, by the way, what does it cast? Oh, he teleport. Wait, his casting is pathetic. I don't think he actually has proper casting. Like, would he cast something this pathetic if he had something proper? I think he actually doesn't have anything. Huh. In that case, I can just summon elementals too. But no, no, no. Let's go with this. Let's go with this. Ah, uh, but I, but like, these cycles are actually the biggest threat right now. Ah, uh, the Shen Lightning is pretty good. Does it kill the Ballista, actually? No, it doesn't. Wait, no, it's already hurt, though. Hmm, it almost does. But just barely, barely not. I mean, the Catapult? No, then again, the Catapult doesn't really matter. I can hypnotize the bird in order to gain speed priority, but that doesn't actually do anything, so... Eh, whatever. The Entropy Hits are doing damage, but, like, not that much. I think I'm better off casting here. Yeah, bash him! Yeah, like, three ancient beasts left. What is he gonna do with that? Like, he can summon air elemental. That's fine, but that's not that strong. I could maybe get a... Maybe it's gonna be time... Oh, that's pretty good. Okay. Alright, alright. But now he's like down to almost a single stack. Huh. Interesting. Oxygen! Yeah, I thought you last saw the last of me, but I'm back. Your worst nemesis is here. Yeah. <laughs> does he have chain lightning? That's the question, actually. If he doesn't, then I don't know if he can handle this even. Hmm. Oh, he has oxygen too. Wait, is that really his best cast right now? He needs to be proactive. He doesn't win the long game after all. Uh, I 
like he's setting me up for some sort of combo, maybe. Like, I could blast the side right now entirely, like this. Then I kill all the oxygen, the catapult, the these, and maybe some of these. But that's like pretty weak because it dies to chain lightning of his. No, actually, it doesn't, probably. Would, how, could he possibly have like the spellbinders hat? That's where he got sacrificed from. And that's why he can't chain lightning me. That would make a lot of sense. In that case, this is a pretty powerful cast. I certainly do not want to anger the ancient behemoth, so yeah, I'm just gonna chill. We want to be waiting out his mana. Does he have any speed RTs? No, he doesn't. He's on base value speed. Is this Paul Bonded Band? Is it? Is it? No, I don't think it is. Where is my Paragon gameplay? Ah, uh, that was yesterday. Guys, it might be confusing the Virgins quite a bit as well. Yeah, okay, what does that do? Like, what's the idea here? Uh, I guess the idea is to uh, actually a tempo while surviving. Hmm. No, it doesn't feel too strong. Let's almost get rid of it. I really need to kill some of the behees, but I like. I'm almost in Lightning Bolt's lethal range, you know? It's pretty bad. I could be waiting. Moving down, and then Chain Lightning kills this, this, and these. Then he has to kill two stacks. One with Lightning Bolt. How many are, is my Lightning Bolt killing? Just to get a perspective of his Lightning Bolt. 62. Yeah, so his one would probably kill 51. Or it would be like very, very close. Yeah, I would be hitting my own elementals with the chain as well, so. Uh, I think for now what we should do is we should OXYGEN! Yeah, okay, that's good. Mm. Need more air copium. Uh, yeah. The more oxygen, the better. I could be brawling his oxygen, actually. With both of my oxygens. Yeah, let's get some oxygen on oxygen action. <laughs> my favorite. <laughs> I saw, like, quite a bit more mana than the opponent, so... All aboard the oxygen train! Yeah. Hypnotize? Is that really your cast? Is that the best you can do? Like, that's pathetic, isn't it? Isn't it? Okay, so what is my response? I mean, yeah, it's a pathetic cast from him, but... Am I gonna be any less pathetic? That's the question. I mean, I can anti magic, but oh, there's no anti magic. Actually, this spell is a pretty good cast now. Or is he baiting me to do that? Hmm. The spell is kind of getting lethal, almost. Is the spell getting lethal by prayer? Uh, these deal with these. Huh. Or I could, like. <laughs> if I dispel, then he's no longer having prayer. That's kind of annoying. That's like so weird though. I need to like get rid of some of these ancient beaches really. Fifty nine does this. If I remove prayer, then he's down to speed ten. He's still gonna be outspeeding me with pretty much everything. Yeah, okay, more oxygen. OXYGEN! Someone told me that Lithuanian has no swears. Is it true? Uh, we have swears, but our swears are... <laughs> <laughs> um, 
They're unique. And we don't release them, so we just use other swears. They're not really swears, they're like, eh, something. Okay, he's running out of bees. Alright, alright. What's up? What happens after the battle? If you have, uh, if you win while having all of your non-elemental creatures then, um, the winner, in one hero format, um, the one to win with elementals just wins, that's all. If I were to chain, do I survive the next turn? I might not. So I might not want to try and do that. This guy moves first too, that's so annoying. Can he like, stop existing? Just die. I probably just want to live. I don't want to... Yeah, I don't want to play aggressive right now. If we survive, I think we win, so... Yeah. Currently we are building up uh, the oxygen count, so that's pretty good. I don't know if he even has Lighter Bolt. He doesn't feel like he does. I think I win, but that's like so weird. <laughs> yeah, that's like super, super win. Okay, I think I'm safe to cast now something aggressive like this. Hold you. Then all I have to do is retreat. <laughs> nice be here. He closed the gate! He closed the gate! Oh no! And then he's slogging up the gate because there's no oxygen. He can't pass the oxygen, he's blocking the way! <laughs> okay, bro. Wait, actually, he could have lethal me. Like, a lighter bolt and hit might kill the air elemental, and if it did, then oh my god, I would have lost. Wait, I actually was real close to losing. Oh! Shampo! Not bad, bro. But we have more oxygen! <laughs> My favorite! <laughs> Yo, Feral? <laughs> Breathe in! <laughs> Breathe out. <laughs> he will never expect my next cast. <laughs> my next cast will shock him. Little did he know that we have oxygen. Draw your last pathetic breath. <laughs> okay. There we go. Is it just like for playing? <laughs> but wait, there's more. Dude, he actually didn't have spell casting. Oh my god. He's like, okay, I'm in a battle. What do I what do I do now? I'm supposed to cast spells? Hmm, what spell do I cast? I guess I'm gonna teleport. <laughs> Winning by breathing. Uh-huh. Yeah, what the hell were his, was his spell casting? How did he have oxygen but no chain lightning? What the hell? <laughs> is this a new duel? Summoning a lamb. This is uh, Jeebus, uh, This is duel 2.69i, which is uh, basically Jeebus Outcast 2.69i, the way it used to be. Uh, because the version was popular, due to popular demand, I guess the and the um, MTC ended up making that an option for players to play. Yes, but I told you! I told you! No, Lexi! No, you don't understand! There's no spellbinders! There's not! <laughs> okay, okay. Easy. 
Yeah, I mean, it was pretty clear. He was summoning oxygen and sacrificing as one of his only casts. It was filled with your fives plus water. <laughs> he, there's no spell bind, he just cheated that in, okay. Hell, she had before a bit point. I need to know if this is hard play. It's always hard play. Always. Uh, okay, so Jeepers Outcast, uh, Duel 600 Plus, my favorite. Let's go. But where'd he get prayer? I think he have. I think he just had water book now. Is summoning air elementals better than summoning earth elementals? No, it's not, but there's no earth elementals in Jeepers Outcast. 